Uh, what we have here is uh, Sir Hoax's series cell, the way I envision it. I took my little uh, glue gun and I glued all the edges of this thing so it can only get water in through the bottom. Water comes in through the bottom, circulates around, and then comes out that small hole in the top. Here. I'm going to plug it in, give it a little shot, open hair. I hope that our electrolyte, this is older electrolyte, so uh, let's take a look and see what a series cell does. Right at 11 amps. Ooh. So I think what we're going to end up having to do is add uh, some more cuts back there. Look at this little dude go. 11 amps. 12 volts. I think what we're going to have to do, like I said, is probably open up the little passageways for the uh, water to come in there. I don't think I got enough flow. What I was counting on was uh, once the cell temperature got up, you get a little bit of thermal convection action going on there. All right, here's my little flow meter. Little flow meter has about a right at one pound of back pressure on it. Water's at ambient temperature. Let's connect up our little flow meter here. Let's see what we got. Let's see. We're going to start it right at two minutes. Of course, the water is still cool. Okay, we're producing gas now. Started about two minutes, three seconds, something like that. We're producing, producing gas. I don't think we have any leaks. It's going right on down. Two minutes, 24. This is a half a liter of water we're moving here. 11 amps, 12 volts. So, pound of back pressure, a lot of back pressure actually for this little system. In my book, we can calculate the free flow knowing what we got here for back pressure. So, let's see. Well, we're not quite there yet. This is uh, 500 milliliters. That's one minute, just about. At one pound of back pressure. We're pressing 500 milliliters. That's a pound of back pressure. And I didn't realize that, I guess I wasn't paying attention and water weighs quite a bit. So, let's see where it one minute twenty nine when well pretty close we've got a little leak not much of one so but this little guy is producing pretty well I think we're still gonna like I said we're gonna open up the back uh, vents to get a little bit more water flow through the uh, system okay so we're right at almost two minutes. We are at two minutes to the system. But I may not have it. There it goes. Two minutes and uh, it looks like about ten seconds to produce 500 milliliters. That's, that's still not too bad. But again, it's a cold cell. I assumed that it would produce quite a bit more as it warmed up. Anyhow, that was our first test of the uh, Sir Hoax series cell. And it looks like it's going to be a winner all the way around. I got no leakage on the edges. That's good. I'd like to see PWM on this. Well, anyhow, this is my first one for today. Sir Hoax's series cell. 
see if I can get that. 11 amps, 12 volts, a little over two minutes, about two minutes, two seconds to produce 500 milliliters. I'll reset it. We'll give it a shot a little bit later. Thanks for watching.